Hi, not all burger joints were created equal. With 20 mouth-watering burgers available, all cooked to order using fresh, premium quality ingredients, we're pretty sure you love every last bite. We're located at 320 Packington Street in Newtown, 51 Moorabool Street in Geelong, and for information on the menu, check out burgerinc.com. So come on in, we'd love to feed you. It's gonna kick the one the lead of McQueen! Couldn't mark the ball, who's at ground level? There's three players there, trying to get a handball out to someone. Then he went backwards, but there's that player Lovick. God, he's good, he's everywhere. Could have got a free kick, but that boy said play on. And he goes back in and tackles McQueen. McQueen on the left, kicks it, go! Oh! Oh, you are, you little ripper! Who has marked on the point of the goal square? This will sell it up. If he can kick this, it'll make it. And I'm whore because I've done me throat. <laughs> you are. I'm, I'm horse. <laughs> no comment. You wish you were horse, don't you? Anyway, a big whore will come Harry in. Kay. Harry Kay. <laughs> Harry. Do you reckon Big Horry had something on Harry Kay on Wednesday? Uh, no, but whore's going to go bang. bang. Oh. They're home. They're home, oh. St Mary's. Oh, I wouldn't say they're home, don't you? I'm still... There's still at least five, I'll say at least five minutes, I could be right. And try to find a teammate, here comes Rudd, Rudd for St. Joseph's, gave a quick handball over to Bolton, Bolton used his pace and a bit of his guts and determination, but the ball went over the bounder, not out of bounds for a throw in. Doc's pocket. So right where Doc's pocket is at Lammy's Tavern, and geez, I bet you've been there a few times, Zeta. And now Paul spins the ball back into play, and he does, he spins it in, and I don't know look at spinning, because it come out the back, who's there, here comes uh, the player in Woods, Woods, Woods gets under the right boot and just bangs it onto his boot and kicks it out, about 60 out from goal, Jennings gets around his uh, opponent and then shows the dummy, good play young man, kick it on the left boot to Stanich, he tried to take a slip catch and it went out of his hands, over the bat run out of bounds for a throw in. 50 metres out from the St. Joseph's goal. They yeah, really need one. He hasn't been too bad today, Michael Jennings. Never, he's been great. Yeah, he's been good. He's been, good. Good. He's been, he's been all right. Yeah, yeah boss spun the ball back into play, and here comes uh, that player in Bow. Bow goes in and tries yeah, to find the handle, but he can't. Now he does. He tried to get out of his mate in Baker. Baker's looking for the ball, but the up boy comes in and says, oh, bounce, and stacks on the mill. And stacks is on the mill because they're home, I reckon, St. Mary's. Two goals up, four minutes to play. Hope tried to push his opponent uh, in Probably the back, good. and he did. Got a what quick kick out of the pack, there's King, or is it Podbury? Come out to King now. King got a play in the back. It's a push in the back. And he got a free kick. Number 27. And you hear them yelling stuff from the barrel line here, Jack. I don't think there's long to go. They're a bit urgent. Kick. The ball 21 and a half the gone. 21 and a half gone into the final term. Yeah, still a bit of time. Left, right. There's still a bit of time. Three yeah. minutes to go. You'll need to nail this, Jack. What price? Two goals in the... Uh, what well, price King to kick this. He'll kick this. King comes in, and King, King, and King goes behind the stick. Well, it could be any point. Two oh, goals yeah, the they east. Need a goal now. Oh, they just need goals. They don't need points. Well, they need a goal. That's right. Well, to win the game, they need at least one. They need a goal now, don't they? They probably need one. Then they... Time's ticking. Tick, 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 tick. Not long to go. 22 minutes gone. Hosking to bring the ball back into play for St Mary's. Go short to Walton in the pocket. Called the play on now. Goes with a long kick up the... Pretty much up the centre of the ground looking for Gilligan. Hope's got the Corey Bell could have marked and knocked it down to his mate there in Brad King. King inside. Tyron Baker picks up the left foot and snaps out on the full. Could have done better than Tyron Baker. He's had a pretty good day so far. A lot of tired players out there. So it's going to be Hosking to take the free kick. Where's the so Jim Kale, is it? Kale. Kale will kick it straight up the line like a smart footballer would. And he does. A Kicks it looking for Hosking and Bauer. No one can take the mark. Goes out of bounds. About 55, 60 metres around from the St. Joseph's goal. Where they trail St. Mary's by 11 points. Couldn't be long left now, Dean. There's not it's a couple of minutes. I reckon Gilligan run the tap down. Here comes Merriman. Just sh showed a bit of guts and determination. Got oh, tripped. He wasn't legged. He got tripped. The up said he got tripped. They've done a fantastic job this afternoon. The up in yeah. orange, not in white anymore. They're in orange. Maddox all on his own in the middle. He is all on his own, but he's going to go down the outer side, Merriman. And he does. Kicks it to the outer side, looking for a teammate out there. And here comes McLean. He got a punch oh, on it. Over, 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 back, over, back, over. Will, back will gives a handle away to Snowden. Snowden gave a handle over the bars. And you're in his guy go. He puts the oh, other oh, down. That was a shot of goal. Oh. And kicks a goal. Missed point. That's no, a point. Oh. 
Jeez. I tell you what, he's made a big difference since half time. Yeah, the kick has been marked out there by the St. Joseph's player. He gets around his opponent, puts it down and kicks it to the other side and Bowel need to go up. But McLean, that was uh, the big boy McLean trying to get it out. Now he comes back in. He yeah, has to look like a throw to me. He but did. He hit the ball the ball out. Play on. Here comes Merriman. Merriman could have got over the ball. Over the ball. Judd got it over to Bow. Great handball by Bow and Ferris Baker. Here comes St. Joseph's. He goes, he goes, away. Away to go. he goes back out of Bow. Bow kicking it away. Oh, 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 short. Hope. Hope marks the ball. They've got to go long. Oh, oh they've got a shot. Gee, surely he can make the distance from there. He probably have any legs. He might have any legs. He should have a shot, but he kicks it. Oh, he kicks it to King. And King couldn't get it. And then Hosking punched the ball over the boundary line out of bounds for a throw in. Nah, Why would he have a shot? He probably didn't think he could make the distance. Though. Jeez, 50, 50 you would have had a shot, Zeta. You would have had a shot. Yeah, I would have a shot. Even if Jack I would have had a shot. The up boy spins the ball back into play. Here comes Hope. Hope and Gilligan and Gilligan get it out of the pack and kick it toward Fuchs. Oh, Fuchs he plays on. Kicks it toward goal. Oh, Mungrel looking kick. The but it's going to get there. That's the one they wanted. It's going to get there. And he gave it a one-two. And here comes the Josephs. Down. There's a scrap. Four or five players over the ball. Up. They've all dived on that. Someone's knocked the ball out the back. It's picked up there by Maddox. Maddox on the right inside 50. Only as far as that man. Best player on the ground, in my opinion, is Daniel Lovick. Lovick on the right foot. Kicks out to his mate, Brad King. Good small there by Paul West. Very good small. Knocked out of bounds. Centre wing for the Samaritan side. And they lead by one goal with 26 and a half minutes played on the Blood Toyota scoreboard. Hope comes in. The ball's thrown back into play. Hope. Uh, knock the ball down. There's a scrap. Lavaz has got it. Got to get your hammer out, mate. There's no one tackling you. It's our own teammate. Maddox. The no, no, no. He pinged him there. Yeah, he would. He could have pinged Lavaz before it, but he's pinged the wrong bloke. And he's now pinged. Who was the guy? Who was the... On the ground, who's that? Maddox, uh, Maddox was it? Yes, it was. Yeah, Josh Maddox. Maddox. Probably a bit rough. Anyway, Corey Bauer. Saw no. him on the rod. Rod with Gilligan in pursuit. They've got to go gets long. Up. They've got to go long. They're wasting too much time. Rod makes a hand on the left foot. Kicks it to 50. West got the front position. But that guy's a closing. Good mark. He's got to pay that mark, don't they? Anyway, the ball's knocked the ground in front of West. Man. The St. Joseph player played the free kick too high. There it is. There's the siren. There is the siren. Oh. And St. Mary's have prevailed here at True Reserve by one goal. Best player, but I know he's a bit disappointed. They never won the game. Daniel Lovick, congratulations. The promoted trophy award uh, for the best player on the ground today. A uh, bit disappointed uh, with the game, uh, Dan? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think it was just so disappointing to lose after half time the way we started. I think we re had a real focus on starting starting and getting those first couple of quarters down pat and then we'd move on from half time but obviously they got to jump at three quarter time so we we just tried to keep going but obviously it's very disappointing to lose by that much and we just want to look forward to next week now so uh, we, we did mention in the in the commentary box that uh, until half time you, ra you ran the ball very well through the midfield your back line uh, you and your brother and belly and those were very good in the first half but in the second, in the third quarter, when when you, you need to continue that, they just come out and start running the ball themselves, didn't they? Yeah, well, I think... They move the ball better. Yeah, they're, they're, they're a bloody good side, and I think they, they we always knew they were going to come back at us and knew they were always going to work hard. And we just thought we had to really be on our man and uh, try and lock down that way and see if our midfielder can do... Midfield can pick up the slack, but obviously um, they just got on top of us in the midfield, and they and we sort of didn't really weren't, weren't quick enough to counteract what they were doing. So, yeah, Miss Butch, it goes. Uh, Butch Shaw today. Oh, definitely, he's been a great pickup for the club, and just the way um, he goes about his football and his run and drive out of the middle is just exceptional. And yeah, definitely missed it, but hopefully he'll be right right in a couple of weeks. All right, so. all right mate, congratulations. The promoted trophy award for best player in the grand today. I know you uh, you can go and show that to your teammates. Bit disappointed on your loss, but uh, there's always next time. Yeah, no worries. Thanks, Jack. Good on um, you, mate. Work Thank hard for Colac. Thanks very much. Good Thank on you, mate. At Ellsworthy's Retrovision, we're more than just the best price. We'll give you expert advice with a huge range of big brand products. Locally owned and operated in Geelong, Eldsworthy's Retrovision will give you more every time. If it's a big screen TV you're after, or a top brand washer or fridge, we have the best range to choose from. Come into Ellsworthy's today at two big locations, Mirable Street, opposite Skill Stadium in Geelong, or Warren Ponds Homemaker Centre. Eldsworthy's Retrovision.